If Speaker Pelosi thought that by vetoing Ranking Member Banks and Ranking Member Jordan from this committee that she would avoid the tough questions, well, she doesn't know the rest of us that well. And frankly, some of the questions that I think need to be asked of the Speaker, and I hope all of you that are in front of us today ask these questions. On January 6th at 143, Speaker Pelosi was passed a note while in the Speaker's chair on the House floor requesting permission to seek support from the National Guard from then Sergeant at Arms Paul Irving, who was appointed by the Speaker and then subsequently fired that day by the Speaker. This is an account that has been confirmed by the Speaker's office. Why was the Speaker's permission even needed? By this time, pipe bombs had already been found outside the RNC and the DNC, and rioters had breached the steps. If Sergeant Arms Irving felt he needed the Speaker's approval then, what were the instructions and conversations he had with the Speaker's office prior to January 6th? Former Capitol Police Chief Steve Sun has testified that Irving was concerned, as many have said, about the optics. And we know that the Speaker's office was calling the shots on all of their actions on January 6th. But we don't have the details leading up to those conversa or conversations leading up to the 6th because under the Speaker's direction, the Sergeant at Arms has denied our House administration official request to preserve documents and communications. I will tell you the Capitol Police followed our, our ask and did provide that information. What are they hiding? What is the Speaker hiding? Unfortunately, I don't believe those questions are going to be asked by this committee. And the Speaker, as we've heard throughout this press conference, is tightly controlling every single question that is coming forth. This is a committee that's supposed to get to the bottom of what happened on January 6th. And as has been noted by my colleagues, the chair of this committee has left all of the questions that I just hope you ask the speaker off the table. Don't let that happen. Now I'd like to turn